Hi, my name is Lisa Liu. I'm a registered dietitian at the St. Michael's Hospital Family Health Team. Today, I will be speaking to you about what children drink and how much. In this video, I will talk about what children should drink and when, how much children should drink, what cups to use, and other drinks. What drink should I offer my child? From birth until around six months old, babies need breast milk, infant formula, or a combination of breast milk or formula. During these first six months, these are the only drinks that babies need. When babies start eating food at around four to six months of age, they may start to have small sips of water. From six to 12 months, continue to give breast milk or infant formula until your child is around 12 months of age. Around nine months of age, if your child is eating a good variety of solid foods with iron, you can offer a small amount of full fat cow's milk to replace some of the formula or breast milk. By 12 months old, if your child is drinking formula, you can switch to full fat cow's milk with 3.25% milk fat instead of formula. After one years old, if you have stopped offering your child breast milk, you can give cow's milk instead. For any reason your child does not drink cow's milk, the information discussed does not apply and you should speak with your healthcare provider to find out what drinks are appropriate to offer by 12 months old. How much should your child drink? At around four to six months, as your child starts eating solid foods, they will start to drink less breast milk and formula. From six to 12 months of age, most children will drink about 24 to 40 ounces a day or 700 to 1100 milliliters a day of formula or pumped breast milk given by bottle. If you are breastfeeding, this will be four to five feedings a day. If you are providing a combination of breastfeeding and formula, the amount of formula provided will be much less. For water, aim for a maximum of four to eight ounces or 125 milliliters to 250 milliliters of water a day. Just like adults, children come in different sizes and a smaller child may drink less than a bigger child. At 12 months of age, the total amount of cow's milk or breast milk should be limited to 16 to 20 ounces a day or 500 to 700 milliliters a day. At this age, if your child is breastfeeding, reduce the number of feedings to three to four times a day. Too much cow's milk, breast milk and formula after the age of 12 months old can increase the risk that your child will feel too full for food and not get all the nutrients they need for adequate growth. They can also be at risk of developing low iron in the blood. For water, at around 12 months of age, children can start having a little bit more. Some children may drink around eight ounces of water a day or 250 milliliters of water a day or more. And you can offer water when thirsty. When should I offer drinks to my child? Until your child's six to eight months old, offer breast milk or formula before food. At around eight months of age, start to offer food before breast milk, formula, or water. As your child is getting older, they start to need more nutrition from food. Giving food before drinks at this age helps them to be hungry. Offering foods first and drinks after eating is a habit to maintain as children get older sips of water can be offered throughout the day. Should my child drink plant-based milks? There are many plant-based milks available like soy milk, rice milk, almond milk, and oat milk. At this time, plant-based milks do not contain the right nutrients for growing children up to two years old. If there are concerns that your child cannot drink cow's milk or cow's milk formula, please contact your healthcare provider for recommendations to replace cow's milk beverages. What if my child does not like to drink cow's milk? Cow's milk can be a good source of protein, calcium, and fat for healthy growth in children. Some children do not like to drink milk or are drinking a lot less than we talked about earlier. It is still helpful to continue to offer a small amount of milk to your child in a cup on a daily basis without forcing them so that children can get used to seeing cow's milk as a part of a regular balanced diet. If your child isn't drinking cow's milk, there are foods that have similar nutrients that can be helpful. 
If your child consumes other foods made from cow's milk, like cheese and yogurt, or tofu and soybeans, offer two to three portions of these foods every day. If your child does not consume foods made from cow's milk, please speak to your healthcare provider for suggestions on ways to get enough calcium in the diet. Should my child drink overnight? When babies are born, they need to have breast milk or formula every three to four hours, even overnight. Once a baby's weight is around 12 pounds or six kilograms, they usually don't need to be fed overnight. Most babies reach that weight around five to six months of age. Offering drinks overnight can encourage children to wake up, which affects how much sleep children get. And it is important that children get enough sleep for their brain development. Drinking overnight can also decrease their hunger for food during the day, and this can prevent them from getting all of the nutrients they need. Drinking overnight from a bottle can also increase the risk of cavities. What type of cup should my child use? At around six months of age, your child can start learning how to use a cup or a cup with a straw. This is going to be messy and take a lot of practice. During this stage, giving water in a cup is going to be less messy and give them lots of practice. At 12 months of age, it is time to stop offering your child any drinks in a bottle. At this age, drinks in a bottle can increase cavities and encourage their desire to drink a lot, rather than increase their desire to eat enough food. Using a cup at this age helps your child develop the skills needed to use the muscles in their mouth and tongue and learn how to swallow drinks and foods. Although sippy cups can be used occasionally, they're also not helpful in your child learning how to swallow. After 12 months old, try to offer drinks in an open cup most of the time. What other drinks can I offer my child? There are many other drinks available to children, but most of these are not healthy options. Most have higher amounts of sugar and some have caffeine. Limit juice, smoothies, and drinkable yogurt and coconut milk to no more than 125 milliliters or four ounces a day, as these drinks have a lot of sugar. Avoid offering drinks with caffeine, sugar, and artificial sweeteners like soda pop, diet soda pop, tea, Gatorade, and energy drinks. Avoid adding sugar or sweetened syrups to cow's milk. This can sometimes lead children to expect their drinks to be sweeter and add more sugar into their diet, and it can be difficult for them to learn how to drink plain milk. Should I give my child liquid nutrition supplements? There are several drinks that are advertised as being healthy and important for your child's growth. These are called nutrition supplements. Generally, these drinks are not recommended to offer your child unless your healthcare provided, provider has recommended so. Offering your child a wide variety of foods in a supportive environment will help them to get all of the nutrition they need to grow healthily. When should I contact my healthcare provider? If your child is sick and is eating and drinking very little, or if your child is drinking too much and prefers to drink rather than eat, your healthcare provider can help to make sure your child is getting the right amount of drinks and the right amount of foods to support their health. If you would like more information, you can go to Healthy Drinks, Healthy Kids, 2 to 18 years old from Alberta Health Services. If you would like to discuss your child's health care concerns in more detail, I encourage you to book an appointment with your doctor, nurse, or registered dietitian. Thanks for watching.